I'm sorry to tell you, but if you work as a policeman or a soldier, I don't respect you, and no one should, and you should quit right away. I'll tell you why. There was a fight online between uh, Mia Khalifa, I think you all know who she is, and one soldier, and he was roasting her that she's selling her body for money. And she told him something like, you're doing even worse, you're selling your body for government. And she was kind of right. You are selling your body for your government and you are even risking your life. She is at the bottom of society, don't get me wrong. She is the lowest of the lowest. She has no right to tell anyone anything. But in this case, if you actually think about it, she roasted him and she was right, 100%. Because you think that you all should be proud if you finally got into the police, into the army of any country, whatever country it is, doesn't matter, it's all the same. And you think that you should be proud of yourself, that you're patriotic, that you're fighting for your country. No, you're not. Your country and your government are two completely different things. Because as of today, as we all woken up, we all realize that government doesn't give a fuck about us. They only fight for their own interests. They don't give a singular fuck. They don't give a shit about us. They don't care. And if you paid any attention to this, you already know this. You already realized this to be true. So you're not fighting. You're not risking your life for your country. No, you're risking your life for your government, for elites, for the Satanists. We don't give a fuck about your people. And you are giving your life, you are actually selling your body for nothing. For the Satanists and their evil plans, their evil agendas. You should be ashamed of yourself. You should quit that job right away. God will help you. You will find a new job. You will find a way to survive. Don't worry. God loves people with pure heart. But you, if you continue doing this job, even though you know it's so wrong on so many levels, but you're scared that you won't find any other source of income, that you are wrong. And God will punish you for that. Be brave. Quit it and God will help you find a way. Trust me. Police is nothing but an army for the mafia because we all know politicians and our governments is just legal mafia. We all know this. They don't give a fuck about us. They steal all the money. They do all of these shady contracts with other countries that we know nothing about. You don't know shit about what's going on behind the closed doors. You don't have a clue what your government is actually doing with your taxpayers' money. You don't know shit. They're giving money to support wars, to support countries that you don't give a shit about while you are struggling to pay your bills and to pay your rent and to pay your food. You have no idea how evil this world is. Every country, every government, it's all the same. And if you are a policeman or a policewoman, whatever, you're actually defending these Satanists who fuck over your own people every day. Your army, your soldier, you're willing to risk your life not for your country, but for your evil government, for your elites who are trying their best to put as much money in their own pockets 
not giving a singular fuck about your citizens and you think you should be proud of yourself and that you're patriotic no if you are in police or in the army in a lack of better job if you're doing this just because you don't know any other way just quit it you'll find a way you'll find money you'll survive but I don't know how can you sleep at night knowing that you're nothing but a toy soldier for the legal mafia bosses. It's all they are. Government is a mafia, but a legal one and the strongest one. You can't do nothing to them because they have all of you, police and soldiers. They have the biggest army and they are legal mafia they can do whatever the fuck they want and you are part of that problem just quit i have no respect for any soldiers and police officers whatsoever because i know what you actually are and i'm telling you just listen to me and make the right decision as you can see in the uk People are getting arrested for comments on Facebook and I don't know how that police woman on a video has audacity to just come into his house and actually arrest him for comments on Facebook. I know she has to follow orders but don't you have a single thought behind your eyes? Are you at least thinking in your mind what the fuck am I doing? What the fuck is going on? We've came to the point where I'm arresting this guy for comments on Facebook. Are you mental? Arresting people for comments online. Arresting people for tweets. But no, this is reality that we all live in now. It started with UK and it will spread like a cancer into every country. We should not let this happen. As you can see, UK and every country will just start making even worse and worse laws. Taking away our rights as human beings every day more and more. Until there is no rights they can take away from us. Until they took every single right and will to live away from us, they won't stop. And you, police and soldiers, want to be on their side, you know people will stand up, you know there's gonna be civil wars, and you will end up fighting your people. You, as patriotic and as proud as you are, will end up fighting and killing each other, fighting a civil war with your own people, because of your evil governments, because you're nothing but a puppet to the fucking mafia bosses, to the satanists, to the elites who only protect their own interests they don't give a singular fuck about us you are fighting for the wrong side you're fighting against your own wake up, quit your job God will help you find another one and stop being a puppet Stop being a rich man's toy. Stop being this toy soldier to these mafia bosses. And finally join your people and your country on the right side of this war. Civil wars in every country are inevitable. It's coming. Don't fight your own people. Don't do this. Don't side with elites, with satanists, with mafia bosses. Because in the end, Jesus Christ will come back. God will help us. And as always, we will win this war. With or without you.